it's also feeling good, you know? When you smiley bend your knee and you feel the stretch of the lower side. It's still good, isn't it? Yeah? So if you roll up and you keep your center slightly curved in close, and from here you start to bounce a little bit on the hip line, that's when you start to have a, a bounce up. Now, from here to the next step, to the next movement, I want you to always be able to finish. And this is a little bit of controversy between uh, teachers, because who say your body should be forward, who say your body should be straight? Now, samba is a dance created by the pushing from the back foot to the forward. Yeah? So, it's not like what we do in Rumba Cha Cha Cha, where the body weight is going off balance for when you catch your body weight. We actually push our body weight from foot to foot. All right. Now, is it forward your body? Probably a little bit. Why is it forward? And this is a little bit of how much. Yeah? We are straight in this action here. If we are straight, we are open. We are not open like completely, but we are not closed, so we are straight. At this point here, I want you to collect. Yeah? Collect your center into your back. Yeah? So at this point here, the moment that you using your foot to push your body forward, it's less heavy than if you're straight to do this. Yeah? So everything is starting from the center and you collect your body into it, into an action out. Now, I did something, I did explain you what I did. So we collect the action here. Now how to move forward? Obviously we don't want to move uh, flat. We want to have one side uh, priority forward. And then in this case, if I have to go forward with the left, what I'm going to have, I have my side give me direction how to move next. And, yeah, so I'm going to keep a little bit on my center here. My foot are lifted up, so I have a compression on the foot. And at this point, I want to have one side going forward. And the going forward, it's balanced by straight my body. Yeah? Oh, straight my leg. In CBM position. Yeah? So, and uh, at the end of an action. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> so, when we do this action here, I want you to extend the step, the step forward, control the action back, and now, between two legs, extend the leg in front by controlling the foot behind. Good, then part to a position. Now this is the, the most difficult part, but it's the timed one. I want you to lower the heel in front by rotating the hip in the back. So now down. Yeah? So I don't want to do this. The more I do this, less I rotate the hip in the back. So from part weight, I want you to rotate the hip behind and allow your body to be very much forward. Okay? Now, my left side is in front. I want to start the using of the pendulum and the collecting of the free leg be behind underneath my body. Now, I have a normal swing of the hip. Yeah? So, there is no point for you to contract early. Yeah, we want to have this action here, pendulum, of the hip and the replacement of the standing leg in one action. Yes. And in half beat. Yeah? And go. And again, extension forward, keep your side long. In this case, right side, okay? Lift it up. Yes. Lower your heel, rotate your body, 